Is there a really short scenario for this one? I mean... This one's 15 minutes. I suppose we could probably tick that off. Although I don't know what the performance will be like. Okay, let's quickly try that. Very, very quickly. Um, I'll probably cut these streams into two streams. Who knows? Um, because saying, please be mindful, won't do much to them. Oh, Monday plans. <laughs> Monday plans. And can only go on VC uh, if the room is to myself, which usually is the case, but not always. Yeah, I get that. Push to talk does sound best if there are others within the premises. It sucks because I'd love to talk freely. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you can stream Minecraft on VC from an internet cafe. Maybe that would be um, more private. Uh, I've heard people who seem to join some voice calls from inside a running tumble dryer. <laughs> Now, I don't know what the performance will be like on this, because if I remember correctly, this route does get a bit laggy, but I don't know which section we're on. Um, good afternoon, engineer. Starting here at Hoboken, this scenario will take you straight through to Newark Penn on the first part of a run down to Bayhead. Before you start off, open the doors to allow passengers to board. Yeah, this is uh, not great looking that way. I think it's because of all the trains there as well. Yeah, if I look this way, it is a bit smoother. But if we look over that way where all the trains are, uh, you're not great. Um, but we can try it anyway. So this is New Jersey Transit. Uh, this is, I think, a Siemens imported locomotive. So also a European make. And we've got a cab car on the end. Does this have passenger views? Oh, it does. Lovely. Which... Ah, because we're looking backward, I think it's less laggy. Um... But I know... But I just know that, as... Has happened in the past streams, I will be disturbed for a question that really can wait. Oh, Sorry to hear that. Groceries, should I? Oh, uh, grow cycles, grow cycles, grow cycles, grow sure. Okay, let's set off, and I will look uh, out this window. Not actually, let's double check the signal. Um, okay, yeah, that is, I think, 15 going through there. So I look this way, not because it's particularly interesting out there. But because it's less laggy. <laughs> oh, and opening the window actually changes the sound. Interesting. Haha, <coughs> uh -huh. how did you find out my notebook? <laughs> how, did you how did you find my notebook? Uh, well, you said how you cleaned, uh, cleared up your room recently. Well, let's just say the lack of a mess makes things easier to locate. Not just for you, but for others as well. To rhyme with Isocles? <laughs> to rhyme with Technicles. Ah, very nice. Um, keeping an eye on the speed. That would be telling. Does it have stickers on the front? <laughs> I love stickers. That would be telling too. Put ranks in stealth next time. <laughs> oh right, yeah, we've got dynamic brakes on this thing. That's good. By the way, if you would like me to explain how dynamic brakes work, feel free to ask me and I might do it. Don't worry, I won't go into too much detail if you do want me to tell. Um, okay, there's a 30 limit coming up. Still got lots of laggy trains on the right, unfortunately. 
Um, perception should do the trick too. And buy spyglass. 1,000 gold pieces. That's nothing. Um, I can't take my PC to an internet cafe. Well, you could use one of their PCs. My laptop 100% won't be able to run Minecraft, let alone have the storage for it. Otherwise, I'd always have the room to myself, as I did for games night. Oh, right. Catenary also makes it lag, I think. Mm. Well, I, th I don't think that the catenary makes too much of a difference. Although, I will turn off the lights. Wait, speeding? I don't think that the speed limit was lower. Yeah, I think turning off the interior light... Yeah, turning off the interior light does make it a bit smoother as well. Actually, speaking of that, I do also need a little thumbnail for this. Okay. <clears throat> Just make sure that I'm not going to speed. By that I mean try to not speed. Um, we were passing through the original Morris and Essex Railroad uh, tunnel under Bergen Hill built in 1876. The parallel tunnel to the left was built by Delaware, Lackawanna and Western Railroad in 1908. Interesting. Uh, right. Siemens Charger, yep. <clears throat> as far as I know, yeah, ah. Uh, um, Grossicles, yes, as in Technicles. Lovely. Let's turn on the lights a bit. There we go. Ooh. How does this look when we go into the tunnel? Um. Oh, per uh, Pericles. I found a spider in here yesterday. Oh, look at that lovely lighting. Um, did you let him in? Uh, did it break down? RL or in Minecraft, or Minecraft one? Oh, must have come in, come in through the window. RL, sorry, sub sub. Mm. Sub sub. Uh, if it did, I may have let it stay. <laughs> I doubt it. Uh, would you still love me if I had eight legs? <laughs> um, it depends. Are they human legs? I'll be around soon to release it into the wild again. In spirit. In spirit, taps on window. <laughs> Also, I did have three joke ideas. Would be far from a web comic, as they would just be two to three panels, but I would like to draw them soon. Oh, go ahead. Only if six of them are perma cloaked. <laughs> you mean so you can kick people with invisible legs? And then it looks like. It's just a bit that the other when, when they claim that they've been kicked while everybody's watching and n They've seen that you didn't kick them. They th they'll think it's just a bit that they're playing. Is that what you mean?
for now. Zoom into the passenger adverts. Ah, look, a lovely bridge. With a track running beneath it as well. Okay, that speed is 30, that's good. Um, that's what the spider said as it entered the room. <laughs> Would you look a bit like this? <laughs> Only with uh, uh, more legs. I'd love to projectile kick someone far away. That'd be great. Hmm. I wish I could fly. Your wish is granted. Yay! The end. <laughs> yeah, this route has uh, quite a bit of this kind of mainline, this large scale mainline stuff going on. But then there is also the lower section of the route, which is uh, double track and a lot less. Well, it's a lot more kind of. What's the word I'm looking for? Kind of commuter, uh, urban sort of kind of stuff between towns or districts and stuff like that. Not the main three or four track, uh, main line sort of thing. Also, lift bridge. Uh, actually, no, please do not lift. I'm currently trying to drive over you. I would appreciate you to not lift. Huh. I think Scilly or Sicily has a solar flag. Hmm. Sicily. Hmm. Interesting. Huh. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Only one and a half miles to go. Although that's not updating. Oh, under one mile to go, apparently. Actually, no, it's 4.8 miles to go. It's just that the bottom of the thing isn't updating. But we can speed up after this signal. Let's have a little look. Sicily. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I wonder if there's a connection behind the scenes. Glow squid! Um, I'm not sure whether to take that as an insult or a compliment, Emichu. Never knew. See, now Kanko thinks I'm actually a glow squid. You should clarify when you're joking. Hey, what a wonderful creature. Hmm. Do not reenact TTTE, the great race shard ice. <laughs> Bridge jump. Blech. Ha. Huh. Uh, okay, f speed we're going down to 50 back there. It's Monday. Oh, okay. yeah. I went to Sicily some six or seven years ago for a few days. I don't remember it much, but I remember it being quite a nice place. Oh. Well, that's good then. Though our Mount Etna expedition didn't go to plan. Oh, did you fall in? Uh, did did it erupt? I'm not joking. You mean I'm, I'm I'm actually a glow squid? Is that what you're saying? Okay, I guess we'll see how good these dynamic brakes are. Oh, what what happened? Ah, uh, uh, right. Um, Sizzik South, Kearney, Kearney. Kearney Yard is on the left, and we will shortly be heading in onto the waterfront connection. This track was opened in 1991 to allow trains to pass from the original Pennsylvania Railroad to the Delaware, Lackawanna, and Western Railroad lines from Hoboken. I hope you've all got that. Okay, dynamics on. Let's try four. Yeah, Dynamics on 4 gives us a reasonable amount of deceleration. Ok, 
Okay, that's a flashing green there. Does that mean we've got a speed restriction at this signal already? Yep, 45. Ah, that's unfortunate. Should have paid more, more attention to the signals again. Although I suppose if I were playing this more seriously for the points in the scenario, rather than just playing it to have a look at the locomotive and the route, then I'd probably pay more attention. Speed limit's going to go up to 60 soon. There we go. Kind of reminds me of that joke in the Looney Tunes show, um, where Grandma's telling Daffy her World War II spy story. Daffy, did they kill you? They kill you, didn't they? You're not very bright, are you? <laughs> There's one like that in Rugrats. Ah, not seen that show myself, me neither. Although we're gonna go over a flyover, I think, in a moment. Um, Grandpa comes home and says he's been playing Russian roulette. The parents ask, "Did you win?" <laughs> Should I be paying more sig signal signalular attention? That's an interesting expression. You don't really know how Russian roulette works, do you? Hmm. <laughs> I suppose it depends on the... Hmm. I suppose it depends on your definition of winning at Russian Roulette. Um, although I suppose even in that case, the fact that he's there would already answer your question, no matter which definition of Russian... of what Russian Roulette is you are using. Monkey. Oh, I see. Haha. <laughs> mm -hmm. We had paid to go right to the top, but the little minibus, an old 0309 style Mercedes minibus with huge tyres, only took us halfway. All the other tourists had complained to the drivers because they had not received the service they had paid for, and um, there was lots of angry Italian arguing. In the end, the company offered everyone a second tour, but we would be a home by then. Ah, that's not that's not good. Did ah, you know you could have gotten in contact with an ombudsman about that. Do they have those? Uh, I think they've got those for Europe. Yeah, well, in Europe, so I'm pretty sure that you would have had one in Italy as well. Because that's false advertising then. On the left the uh, is the main... I've got to apply the brakes a little bit more. Is the main um, Port Authority Trans Hudson Path Depot. We will shortly be leaving the shared trackage and crossing over to the main northeast corridor lines where we head into New York Station over the uh, Pazayak... Pazayak? Pazayak? Pazayak River on the dock lift bridge. Interesting. <coughs> Wonder why it didn't go all the way. Like, did it break down? Back in my high school, there was this app which would act like a gun, and you could play Russian Roulette. Kinda morbid when I look back how much fun it was. Hmm. Imagine if the app, as you say, instead of killing you, just completely destroyed your you, the phone that you were playing it on, the mo mobile phone. Like, it would... it's like deleting System32 on, on Windows. Now then it then it would be Russian and you could have played multiplayer as well. Okay, it's slowing down to thirty, and then Newark Pen four. Look, we've got elevate a little bit of an elevated abatement coming in. It's quite nice. Ah, uh, I see. So I'm guessing it uses the camera and has a shoot button, which randomly 
that actually plays a shoot sound plus a visual effect? I have no idea. I didn't do any of the bookings, so I have no clue what came of it for us. I was just a an attendee. It was still a cool trip, though. Ah, well, I'm glad you had fun. Tell you what, let's just use the train brakes for this deceleration here. Let's see how good those are. Actually, I think these are manually, manually lapped brakes, which is interesting. I do like manually lapped brakes. When I know that I'm playing with manually lapped brakes. Because you don't want to be playing with manually lapped brakes thinking they're automatically lapped brakes. Because <laughs> that that's how you mess up braking. It was a, a special birthday present for a relative. Ah. Digital Russian Roulette. It was a PNG gun. When you clicked the screen, it was a certain percentage whether it played the firing animation and noise. Hmm. We told it to our heads and everything. Right. I can. I can. I, that explains a lot of. I think that explains a lot about you, Amichu. Hmm. Thank you for this insight into your develop. Uh, into your formative years. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, we're coming into New York. N not New York, but Newark. Pen track four. Uh, oh, volume to the max? I mean... Nah. Before the permissions were a thing, were big thing, there was a game where each enemy represented a real file and kill deleted it. <laughs> yep. Okay, well, we are actually coming in a bit early. Nice. Although I suppose it did speed a bit. Accidentally. Okay, let's break. Let's put it onto service. And then... Yeah, that's a, that's a good deceleration we've got going on currently. I do like the sounds of these locomotives, like when they're slowing down the, the brake squeal. Come on people, get out of the way, I need to take a screenshot before it ends. Oops. <laughs> Hold on. Maybe one like that? Come on, quickly, 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 and there we go. Good. Um, right, that sounds somewhat nice, at least. We were at school, so no. <laughs> In my school days, we went around scanning barcodes of litter to find out the manufacturer's price. Why were you killing each other, Jamie? Good question. Ah, could I have the immersive experience? <laughs> yeah. Now, hold on a minute here. <laughs> Uh, he can't. He's got a schedule to keep, to. Well, I mean, technically I could just do that and, and pause, but we won't mention that to Uh We did, very immersive. <laughs> well, we also played bingo on our teacher's catchphrases. Ah. Eh, I see. Imagine if that concludes the introductory scenario. Let's see how you did. Um, <laughs> imagine if you scanned one of them and it said... Hello, insert own name. <gasps> that would be interesting. You th I would I would think that the app that I was using somehow well that it was using like the I got bronze, that's okay. That that it was use that the app was using the the account of the mobile phone using the name associated with that to put it in. The best one was Asda ringing in the middle of an English lesson, allowing us to tick off the Asda order talk box. <laughs> Interesting. We had loads of fun, but those are one of st stream stories. Hmm. Ah, uh -huh. imagine if that concludes the scenario. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
Right, so because of the lag, the game ran slower, and so that actually took a bit longer than... Actually, no, I think it took pretty much exactly 15 minutes. That's interesting. Right, so I'll cut those into two, probably, and then upload them separately. Actually, let's have a quick look what we will likely be driving next time on this. It will likely be... Uh, wait, is this the Acela for... Yeah, the Acela, which is on the northeast corridor as well. Yeah, I was thinking if we had a different route to maybe drive that on later with quick drive, because the northeast corridor, while this was fun, can get a bit boring. But the thing is, I don't really... I don't think I've got another... American electric route that would really work on. Let's have a quick look. I'll, it'll only take a minute. Um... Yeah, none of those. I'll re-chat in a moment and then I'll end the stream. Uh, yeah, none of... well, no, horseshoe curves. Uh, this is not electrified. Uh, that's third rail electric. Plus it's uh, got issues on my side as well, unfortunately. That's not electric. North Jersey coastline, which, which is what we've just had a look at, but that's laggy. Northeast corridor, which is the one it's got sessions for. That one's not electrified. Um, oh, is this a... Kango, what one was this route? Is this different? Why is this different to the... Huh. Is this a workshop route or something? Pennsylvania... Oh, the Peninsula Corridor, San Francisco to Gilroy versus the normal Pennsylvania... Oh, uh, sorry. Peninsula Corridor. Ah, interesting. Hmm. This one's... Uh, not American. This one's electrified, but I don't think that the uh, SLA train would really fit on it. The other ones are not. That's not electric. That route does not work. Uh, yeah. So it looks like, yeah, the... If we do want to drive the cellar, which I do want to do, it'll have to be on the northeast corridor again. Right, so I'll quit here and then I'll reach chat one time and then we'll end. Um... Our teacher always used to say, how many substitutions do you think I have coming today? Which led to that box existing. Ha! Huh. Yeah. I do get that. Um, right, so I'll quit. Actions shut down. Right. Um, so we had loads of fun, but... Right, yes. Okay, I already read that. I was was very fun, thank you. And he always used to raise and lower his glasses on his forehead every other sentence. <laughs> so that was a box too. <laughs> anyway, thank you for the company today, it was fun. It was, thank you. Uh, we had a uni lecturer who, in each lecture, would mention his daughter who attended a different uni. And the D&D videos too, they've been really enjoyable. Aw, thank you. There's more on the way. Sure it is, a cellar on Sacramento Northern. Found a naturally occurring dam. Yeah, Emmy Chu, the is that like an aquifer an aquifer you found? Is it like a, a big lake that has like a stone wall around it? That's probably underground. Huh. Did he give any additional context? He used to tell us how he met his wife and things like that. Oh, I see. Well damn, wow. I think I've ever seen those in market before. And the iconic part is that we were uh, str 
stretch class meant to working hard. Ah, imagine if you found beaver mobs. <laughs> sure it is, there are two Peninsula College routes, not workshop. Did one of them also crash? Yeah, I think the left one did. It didn't used to, but then at one point it did. My form uh, tutor then was the stretch teacher for the other half. She always used to show us questions in the form, in form and say, this is the kind of stuff our class does. And I'd just laugh with my friends. <laughs> okay. Uh, can you find me a pass? Good lecturer, but I remember very little. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Sand and dirt. Okay. Aquifers aren't underwater lakes? Well, it depends. If you mean the Minecraft generation structure known as aquifers, then they are underground lakes. If you mean real-world aquifers, then it's a bit different because the moisture, the, the water, usually permeates the rock itself and the dirt. And so you have a water table that goes through the ground, where the ground itself is saturated with the water, usually. Because, and I, yeah, because... It's easy to imagine aquifers in real life as just these big underground lakes, but that's not really what they are. Hmm. Uh, right. Preventing the sea from slowing into a cave. Interesting. Uh, flowing, okay. Iconic part. Ironic part. <laughs> All right, yeah. Anyways, bye-bye. See you in 20 hours. <laughs> bye-bye. Good night. Good evening. Farewell. And uh, is it Friday yet? Bye-bye.